You either lost crazy or both. I need to talk to Nick. You may need to favor someday. I like when you only favor stuff. You're just going down. You step to Greasy Uptown. Yo, you ready to put in this work? Self said! Make sure he filled it on the way out. What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Mark Dark. And I'm back with another video. If you're new, if you love power, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Like the video and leave your theories, comments, everything down below. Now, today we're going to be talking about Power Book 3 Raising Canaan, Episode 6. This is the What to Expect video for Episode 6. And this is based off the trailer that they put out. The title of the episode is called Level Up. And the description for the episode reads... Lou's new artist showcase becomes the nexus of the rivalry between Rock and Unique. At the same time, Kanan cooks up a drug selling scheme with Marvin. So those are going to be the key elements in this next upcoming episode. Remember that this episode will not air until August 29th. Yes, it's going to be taking a one week break. This is usually how Power does for you guys that don't remember. Usually Power does a one week break and then they come back halfway through the season so we will be getting power book three raising canaan episode six at the end of the month like i told you guys august 29th also make sure you check out my episode five recap that i dropped last night for you guys and like i told you it was a straight up fire episode now i'm going to try my best to go over all the key facts that we saw in this trailer if i miss anything you guys let me know down below i got a feeling this will be like an explosive episode so let's begin man what did we see in this trailer what can we expect now i believe this guy's name is geronimo he works for unique of course in the trailer we see your boy lulu he goes and he's telling him he wants to speak to unique the question is what does he want to talk to unique about now whatever your boy lulu needs it could be something to do with rock maybe it's part of the game plan to offer him something of course we know that he t he's telling unique look you can maybe, you know, use a favor one day. And Unique is telling him, look, I like favors, especially from you. So we're going to see how this all plays out. I'm going to tell you right now, um, they're on the offense. Rock's whole organization is on the offense. If they think they're going to sit up here and just play Unique and he's not going to know anything about it, they're going to be in a rude awakening. Trust me, because everything seems like it's going real good. I believe that Rock is using Scrappy. Of course, they're trying to infiltrate Unique, in my opinion. And everything seems like it's going well for them, right? Rock is expanding the organization. And Unique is just sitting. He's just waiting for his opportunity. And I got a feeling he's going to take complete advantage of whatever Lulu is going to bring his way. And Rock and her organization are probably going to be like, man, okay, he got us on this one. But... Like I said, this is just my prediction. I just got a feeling they're not going to be able to get unique like they think they're going to be able to get him. Now, also in the trailer, we hear your girl Rock. She's talking to Lulu and Marvin, and she's telling them the new game plan. Now, apparently, she wants Marvin to go handle some business. And hopefully, this time around, Marvin does the right thing. He does not mess up. We know in the description, it says that Marvin and Kanan will come up with this scheme as far as selling drugs we know canon he learned his cooking dance in the last episode he knows how to cook he's probably thinking he's got all the confidence in the world right so we're gonna see man he's gonna be tested we're gonna see if he's gonna do the right thing we do hear rock talk about go uptown to go see greasy so we're gonna figure out who this person is we know we see marvin with a crew and these are some young boys right some young boys um hopefully this whole game plan that he is you know going to pursue works as i told you guys he's messed up in the past made huge mistakes he doesn't have any more room to mess up anymore and most likely him and kanan will succeed only time should tell but the two are definitely forming this bond together and hopefully this time around they get the job done without making any mistakes we see the strap so we know that marvin is ready we know that kanan should be ready but Based off the past, the dude is always making all these mistakes. Now, we can also expect your boy Lulu to be fresh, fly, fitted, ready for this showcase, man. This is what he's been waiting on. Of course, I'm pretty sure it's going to be a lot of artists there. We know that your girl Jukebox will be performing with the Famous. And everybody's going to be at this showcase. It's going to be an eventful episode. Trust me. We know 
a brawl. It's about to go down. Um, of course, your girl Rock, she's all dressed up. And she's going to have an explosive episode as well based on this trailer. Now, I do believe that Jukebox and Famous are going to go up there and kill it. No problems, right? Um, hopefully, more opportunities open up for her. It's good that she's able to get out. Because we know in the last episode, your girl Drew Box went through a whole lot of mental stress, dealing with Nicole, being busted by her moms. Man, very, very crucial episode for Drew Box. So we're going to see what's going to happen to her in this episode. Now, we see your boy Lulu. He's hollering. We hear Southside. And all of a sudden, we see your boy Lulu catch a right hand. And who do you think this guy is that's hitting him, right? I don't know. I got a feeling whoever it is could be connected to unique um just based off the description you know this place is going to be pretty much they said a nexus for this whole rivalry between unique and rock so nine times out of ten these guys have something to do with unique um and they got beef with marvin and they got beef with lulu i don't know what lulu is going to be telling unique as far as this whole favor and stuff like that but apparently it doesn't seem like it's going to go their way so now we get this war. It's going to be breaking off at this showcase. And I got a feeling that your boy Marvin is going to be dropping some people off. Especially after seeing his little brother get caught. He's going to be on one. He's going to turn up. This is what Marvin is good at. Throwing hands. Also in the trailer we see your boy Kanan. Looks like he's running or whatever. Um, hopefully your boy Kanan can get out unharmed. Or maybe he can drop somebody off. This is grown man business man. Ain't no time to be playing around. You have to be ready at any given moment. Now, also in the trailer, we see, which appears to look like to me, it's Rock. That's my prediction. Looks like she has a weapon and she hits this man right here. I don't know who he is. Maybe he's one of the guys at this apartment, but I believe it is definitely Rock. We're going to see once the episode actually airs. Um, but apparently he's catching the beat down and she's not playing around. You also hear your girl Rock talking about Make sure he feel that on the way out. He going to feel it all right. This dude is probably not going to make it. And if he decided that it was a smart idea to put his hands on Rock or try to put his hands on Rock, he's definitely not making it. And I'm eager to see what she's going to be up to in this next episode. This girl is not playing around. As I told you guys, she's been on the offense. She's been trying to, I will say, figure out unique, be three, four steps ahead of the game. Um infiltrate his whole organization with scrappy in my opinion this all sounds great right but then again you just don't know how unique is thinking it seems like it can actually work but unique in my opinion is not just going to go out like that he will counter somehow some way then rock's gonna have to figure out a way another way i would say to try to you know figure out unique as of right now she is doing what she has to do as far as expanding her organization and trying to figure out unique all I'm saying is maybe she should go on a little bit of defense. She should be watching her, her every move because you just don't know what Unique is up to. It's easy to just to go in there and plot and plan, but then again, you have to be ready for whatever he brings your way. And I got a feeling he's definitely going to bring it in this episode. Um, Scrappy, we're going to talk about him this week um, in the videos and storylines that I want to talk about, as well as many others. As I told you guys, the episode six will not be airing until August 29th. So we have some time. I will be breaking down a lot of storylines, the characters, and we just want to prepare, man, and get ready for the second half of Power Book 3, Raising Canaan. And as I told you guys, make sure you check out the episode fire recap. It was straight up fire. And we are definitely going to talk more about Detective Howard and Rock. This whole being the father of Canaan storyline is straight up crazy. But as I told you, it was something that the fans, the hardcore fans of Power they saw this over a year and a half ago because the rumors was that he was the father of Canaan. But we know once they released his description, you know, and it said anything about him being his father. But I'm glad that they still put that into the storyline. I'm eager to see what he's going to do as far as his whole bone marrow transplant. And if Canaan is going to be the one that saves him or if Rock would even allow that to happen. So we're definitely going to talk about that, you guys. But um, thank you for all the love. All the support, and I will catch y'all very, very soon. But let me get on out of here, man. It's your boy Mark Dark. I'm out. Peace.